So far, I'm trying to enjoy Modern Warfare 3, but I can't because you got this stupid skin going on here, okay? Now, overall, the game is pretty solid. I love the nostalgic maps that they have there. I love the movement and gameplay as whole, but there is some issues with this game thus far, and one of the biggest issues is this damn skin. Now, if you guys do not know, the Gaia skin, aka the evil group, is practically in visible okay you can blend in no matter what surroundings you are you can stand still people already camp as bad as it is because that's call of duty for you people camp up in here so now you're dealing with this operator skin that people are abusing right now i ran into a couple of people running with this operator and i'm like yo this gotta go man you need to leave I want this completely out the game and i am backing them with this as well too i would love for this skin to be deleted from the game it's not needed it's completely over p this is a pay to win type of way because people are literally just abusing the mechanics of it like this operator does not have a hit marker it's hard to even tell if this round or not like it's you can't really kill it so it's really hard to kill it's really hard to shoot hit markers hit detection don't really appear up on it and you're pretty much a cloak okay this is like a damn perk at this point where you just run around the map invisible and just blending in with your surroundings and trees and i don't know why they even thought this was going to be a good idea to put this skin in the game and then they said they try to nerf it just try to make it look more a tree but it's really not like I, it's it's see-through you know like this dude is basically blending in i just don't think the skin should be in the game period like take it out of warzone take it out of my own fit three take it out of everything like that should not be a thing at all because this completely gives a, a person a big advantage for using the skin as a whole one thing i really want model fit three to fix is the spawns the respawns is horrendous you could spawn in front of a whole team and get killed you could spawn in front of the enemy team multiple times or even you could end up in their spawns it got so bad that even sledgehammer games is now investigating the bad spawn issues because it's been going around like the rotation is awful i don't know what is going on with this we all know cold duty had bad rotations here and there but this has gotten really bad like you can literally die and just get respawned in front of another teammate or even the whole entire team like <laughs> It's been a few times they spawn me in front of three people. I'm like, yeah, what do you expect me to do as soon as I just spawn? If you spawn, you die. That's that's kind of it. Without having spawn protection or anything to kind of protect you from getting killed by a, a bystander that is already at your team or people camping at your location, it's hard for you to even like move around on certain maps. I've seen this happen a few times where it's like people would just camp at the spawns and just camp there and then a person just come back and they just shoot them. So it's like an easy win, easy kill. So hopefully they can fix that. They took away some maps like... um. Farachi had to go there was in cutthroat and they also did it with the other couple of nostalgic maps as well too like the old model for three maps getting rid of or they start to remove it from certain playlists due to having bad spawns hopefully they can fix it with a patch update that would be really great the guns is pretty cool they actually make you like grind if you want to get these type of um objectives you want to unlock these certain things i love how they have the ability for you to do daily challenges and daily challenges can also equals you to get certain um type of like syntax or grenades flashbangs etc it gives you extra reason to want to grind out the game itself as well as the camos of course but overall i'm enjoying the game but those are the two main factors please get rid of that stupid skin i don't really have much of an issue with skill based match i don't really have much of a problem with it i feel like it's going to always be there they can tweak it more better like probably keep it less or probably don't have it really focus around quick play too much and make it like a separate section for ranked only i think rank only should definitely have a skill based matchmaking but not for regular quick play quick play is just for anybody who just want to game and have fun so you want to have it more fun factor for the casuals and the regular to enjoy you don't want to have just strictly based around esports players and that's pros or call of duty pros will be in the lobbies with you you know that and that then it'll be unplayable at this point but yeah skill based map making is a problem for a lot of people and i know a lot of people have been voicing their opinions on it again is the game just came out we can only hope that it could patch things through along the way but Knowing that it's Call of Duty, we probably won't get any of those type of stuff. Let me know what you guys think about Modern Warfare 3 so far. Which maps do you like the best to use? Which guns do you like to use? Which guns do you like to use? Which is your favorite class? Drop your favorite gun below or your favorite class. Let me know what you guys think about Modern Warfare 3 so far. It's your boy Suzanne. Until next time, peace.